हेलो गाइस दिस इज शोमैन फ्रॉम ऑयल एंड गैस फील्ड क्वालिटी कंट्रोल आई एम हेयर विथ यू विथ ए न्यू नॉट वेरी बिग बट ए सीरीज ऑफ लीक टेस्टिंग टुडे आई केम विथ ए सब्जेक्ट व्हिच इज मोर और लेस सिमिलर टू हाइड्रो टेस्ट बट इट इज टर्म्ड एज लीक टेस्ट लेट अस सी हाउ मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ लीक टेस्ट वी हार्ड अबाउट सो फार what is a leak test first of all for leak test we mean a proceeding that can verify the pneumatic tightness of a piece leak testing is a procedure that inspector used to determine whether an object or system is functioning within a specific leak limit leaks occur when there is a defect like a hole crack or some other kinds of flaw in an object allowing whatever the liquid or gas it is holding to flow out leak testing uses pressure to find these defects so that they can be addressed as a part of regular maintenance procedure in general leak tests are performed on objects that are used to store or move liquids or gases the success of a leak test depends on the object that is being tested different types of material and object may respond differently to high pressures typically used in leak testing to force a liquid or gas out of a defect thus revealing its presence and location unlike most of the types of measurements such as one dimensional or weight this leakage detection almost necessarily a leak tester device you can see some photos of manual pneumatic and custom uh, uh, leak testing and there is a leak testing device also how to measure the leak now application of leak test and the advancement with the technology of leak testing application basically you can say the industry where we use common leak testing as a part of their maintenance process are automotive industry consumer goods medical devices packaging industry or sealed electronics over the last several years advancement in sensors chips valves and other types of technology have helped make leak testing more sensitive and capable as an ndt method All of these advances have made leak testing faster and more accurate and have in turn helped companies to improve the quality of their manufacturing processes and their overall output. One of the biggest advances in leak testing has been the advent of internet of things. Now with an internet connection inspectors can collect monitor and share leak testing data remotely allowing them to get information that they need in a timely manner to ensure ideal maintenance the data can be evaluated not just by the inspectors but also by manufacturing engineers production managers maintenance managers and other stakeholders in the manufacturing process allowing for improved real time insights into the conditions of the assets they are using aids in advance of modern and leak testing some novel techniques refrigerant sniffers there are a number of available instruments that has been tuned to detect a range of refrigerant chemicals the units are generally used as sniffers on air conditioning assemblies freezers coolers system and similar they can be used to locate leaks one can also use these devices to perform an accumulation test and then quantitative result for a leakage value but this is not as common as helium or hydrogen testing other tracer gases example sf6 as mentioned helium and hydrogen are the most common tracer gases to be used to realize the reason for this try to remember your periodic table the two smallest element are hydrogen and helium most light gases this makes them more searching gases for leak detection larger elements and molecules will find it more difficult to progress through a small leak path 
SF6 is a gas that is used as a flame suppression used in electrical switch gear. Some companies using this gas for both leak detection and gas migration in ventilation system. However, it is an ozone depleting substance, so its use recently become restricted. There are other gases which can be used. One just needs to find a suitable detector. High vacuum leak testing. There are two types of tests using high vacuum testing. The first consists of pulling almost complete vacuum, ultra high vacuum by using a special high vacuum turbo pump and looking for a detectable pressure increase. The second one is used when trying to detect the presence of liquid moisture. It uses physical property of liquid that vaporizes at room temperature and very low pressure. So, best leak testing method of for a manufacturer depend on the variety of factors, the quantity of the parts being tested per hour, per shift or per day, the number of open orifices on the test part and current quality standard and cost of quality we can bear. Acceptance limit of leak. Arguably, the most important factor in determining the best leak testing solution is the defined leak limits for the product. Leak limits are defined by an engineering team or industry regulations and ultimately quantify how much a component or system should be allowed to leak. Unit of leak or rates. It is determined by measuring the volume of leak over time, usually through the measure of standard cubic centimeters per minute SCCM or standard cub centimeter per second SCCS. Sensitivity of leak test. Each testing method offer different sensitivity ranges spanning from 10 to 1 SCCS to 10 to 9 SCCS. The accuracy and sensitivity of the leakage requirements will ultimately help manufacturers determine which method is best for their manufacturing process. So we have started with the introduction today for the leak testing, what is leak testing and a little bit about the acceptance of the leak testing. Be with me in the series. We will discuss a little bit in more detail the things we need to know being in a construction industry as we need a clear idea of hydro test, leak test before performing them. If you like the way of my teaching, please do not forget to subscribe my channel and hit the like button. If you like your friends to learn, please share my channel link to your friends. Thank you. Signing off. Showman.